to join a windows device to enter id we go to the settings app and uh, the accounts blade on the left where on the right side we get the option to add the work or school account click on the access work or school account and click connect on add work or school account there we have two options at the bottom to join it to the enter id or the adds i will join it to the enter id from the first option and will provide the credentials of the user account who has been granted as device enrollment manager role in intune in the previous video you have seen now i will authenticate using this user account and because i have configured the option that the registered or joined devices to enter id will be automatically enrolled into intune later you will see in the exercise that this device is part of intune now i will click on join after verifying the tenant information that whether i am joining it to the right tenant or not once this is done then i can synchronize the settings for any policies anything that i want to sync with the entra and intune immediately so i can click on done once this is set up and uh, there below this connected by with the account i have info blade to manage the organization and here from i can click on sync button to trigger the synchronization for the security policies or any network profile or managed applications to keep them up to date on this device now i will see that whether this device is you know registered or joined to the entra id or not for that i can launch the uh, powershell where from i can check but before that let me show you the certificate installed on this device that it is trusted i show you the computer certificate on this device which is entra id joined and the certificate you will see for intune this is the certificate manager for the local computer i'll go to the personal and the certificates store of this where under the certificates i can see three certificates the last certificate you see is issued by microsoft intune mdm device certificate authority i can open this certificate to see the details of this like the intended purpose of this certificate then the details of this certificate like the version the hash algorithm the version that has been used in this certificate and the path that which is the issuing certificate authority for this certificate the certificate seems okay i can open the powershell and see the state of uh, this device that whether this device is joined to the entra id or not to see this i will launch powershell as an administrator there i will run the command dsragcmd space slash status there I will see the state of this device where I can see the device state is Azure AD joint device name is CTL workstation 1 and these are the device details like the device ID authentication status and uh, there we can see the tenant details like the tenant is contoso tenant ID the authentication code URL the MDM details we can check like the MDM URL or MDM uh, terms of use url that we have seen in the previous video that were configured in the enrollment of the intune in the enrollment blade for the devices in intune portal if you have not watched that video please do watch it so the device is uh, joined to the entra id now it is time to sign out from this account and log in with the work account that we have used to join this device to enter id with user account aran let us log in with this work account i will click on other user and will provide the account and the password this is my work or school account formerly known as organization id i will log in initially it will take some time to create the profile for the first time now that i am logged in to this device
I can uh, switch to the you know entra portal and see that whether this device is enrolled in Intune or not. In the Intune portal, I'll go to the devices blade to see that whether this device has been enrolled or not. By platform Windows, this was a Windows device. I can see the Seattle Workstation 1 is enrolled into Intune. Ownership is corporate compliant Windows. This is the version of this device. This is how the devices are automatically enrolled to Intune when they are joined to the Entra ID as per the configuration we did in the previous video for the preparation for Intune. Now, if I take you to the Entra portal, in the Entra portal as well, you will see this device as joined to the Entra ID. This is Microsoft Entra joint, whereas in the previous demonstrations, we have seen the hybrid join as well, and we have discussed that at length. You can watch those videos in case you have missed my previous videos and do subscribe the channel for latest updates on my videos into the cloud solutions.